Oh. So, I made a goof, and I hit the wrong button. So I thought I was recording, and I thought I saw the recording, you know, counting seconds and such, and it turns out I was wrong. So, here we are. I made a mess, and I started using our J-Harm to get up there, and we found somebody. Ugh. Oh. Well, <laughs> I am human. Zap! You are meat! Remember I said there was a laser gun? Lasers! And it can make a mess. That's what I did over there when I thought I was recording. So the thing about this, see the little pock mark right there? You just want to zip zap. Oh, is it gone? Nope, not yet. Zip zap. Is it gone? Nope. Zip zap. And now it's gone. It's a, it's a duration thing, right? So duration triggers the uh, damage, duration triggers the fix. So that's just something to keep in mind. Hey, buddy! Woo! How you doing? Having a roll around? Whee! Alright, so we're just wandering. We're just prowling around. We're not going to zap the legs. The legs can stay for now. Okay, so we've been working on our buckets a bit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. So, remember, bullet holes. What do we do with these guys? Pretty much the same thing. Whee! There we go. Nice and clean. See? And then, probably saw our little sniffler. Whoops, that's dirty. Probably saw our little sniffler. So this is our sniffler. I can't quite show this to you in my hands, but in a different level, we will get to see this, right? So... When you turn this thing on, initially it will track, um, oh, how do I describe it? Like, uh, biohazard, right? So here it's going crazy, like, oh my gosh, there's, oh, it's dirty, get it, ew, ew. Right, you go away, it's like, oh, 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 okay, right? Now, bullet holes are seen as a type of filth. They will count against your score. Woohoo, look at this going nuts, oh, right? But you get away from it, and it kind of goes, oh, okay, okay. See, these don't quite count as um, the same kind of thing. They won't be tracked by the sniffler. These won't be tracked by the sniffer. But bullet holes! Oh my gosh, bullet holes! And see, if this is filthy, which is really hard to see, but if there's filthy you actually need to clean, it'll pick up on that, be it, you know, soot or something else. See, it's picking up on the soot here, not necessarily the meat. Whereas this, well, okay, that won't make a bloody mess, but <laughs> it's, see, blood, blood, soot, and then we can turn it off. You can turn it off either way, it'll start either way, it just depends on if you right or left mouse click. And then these guys are good for just chucking on in. Woo! That used to be a whole person. <laughs> There's. <laughs> this is also not a good game to play if you <laughs> if you can't handle a bit of morbidity. <laughs> Here we go. Wee. Okay. Ooh, they're they're really getting crunk over there. What's going on, my good chums? Rad. That was good. Good jam. Okay. And these are all music tracks that come uh, in the game. I in no way um, had any direct influence or input on them. That's just what's in the game for you to jam out to. And assuming that YouTube doesn't just, you know, ban these videos outright, I just thought that it would be nice to have a little music. Now, some of the levels are going to get really big, and it's not going to be practical to have those within earshot. Whoops! Slap it. But, for now, it's not too bad, right? It's got no lyrics, so you can just I can just chat, chat all over it. Alright, so this guy's got a butt. Oh yeah, I went up there, I found a guy. Here, I'll show you a little, a little bit. I can't show you the complete thing, but... So this guy, uh... I don't remember where his PID went. Oh, that's right, you missed it! Oh, I thought I was standing way up here and I tossed it and it went perfectly in the bucket. Oh, I'm so sad you missed it. It was a good one. Okay. Now, this is just 
where he was. <laughs> Just up here. And this fellow had for us a one of those tablets, and he was saying that he was supposed to do an inspection. He hates plants. Not that he really considered the things here to be plants. And he was, because he was nibbled on three times during the inspection, he was going to recommend better security for the site. And we know how that turned out. <laughs> so, yes. <laughs> Good idea. Unfortunately, not implemented. Oh, well, 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 well. You, you need to get a head, not a hand. Whoosh. Oh, that actually worked. I thought it was going to make a big mess. Pleasantly proven wrong. Yes. Sometimes it's nice to be proven wrong. Do 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 do. Hey guy. Oh. Oh. Come on. Look, my name is not Grace for a reason. Oh look, there is another thing back there. What does it say? We should find out. I want these dang old barrels. The reason why I'm keeping all these instead of just burning them or something to make the our level videos shorter is because I just want to show you, you know, how can a person stack them? Well, not that mine is the only way, of course, but it's one of the ways I do it. Alright, so, Herbert Fig, Arboriculturist. Every day it's the same. More teeth, more teeth. I didn't take this assignment just so I could make mutated alien plant species. I'd hope to make new exotic forms of recreational bonsai, Cephalus fraxius. But all I seem to get funding for is more dangerous plant life, each one more deadly than the next. I'm putting in a petition to get reassigned. Maybe I can work, get my old job back. Working with radioactive Brussels sprouts was safe from this shit. Well, you know what? You voiced yourself, and unfortunately, they didn't listen. So, womp womp. We'll slam this barrel. No. Did you have to? No, the answer is no. <sighs> Did I have to run into you? Also no. <laughs> but it happened all the same. Wah! Get out of here. And throwing. I'm just gonna make a mess. Okay. Do 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 do. And thankfully, I am not having much trouble in any of the other levels, or this one, with having enough space allocated for barrels and crates when it is a level that has allocated space for barrels and crates. There are a few levels that don't have any designation, and if you leave any behind, some of them will count against your score uh, on some specific levels, and some will not. So, it really depends on the level, and it depends on what exactly the kind is. So, we'll get, we'll get more into that later. But for now, you know, we're just having a good time, picking up meat bits, jamming out to some bongos, festive, festive bongos. This is a broom. This does not count as any kind of dirt or filth or leaving. You can leave all the brooms exactly where you find them, and it will not affect a dang old thing, except maybe once in a while your character or an object might trip on them because they do still have physics. See? <laughs> they do still have hitboxes. So, just know that that will play into it a bit. Whoppa! Usually I like burning these orange crates, but. Whoppa! First time through, we're going to see if we can stack all of them. Yeah, Stack all of them we find in a level. And the extras we will incinerate. Oh yes, get back down here. Get, get, get down here. Come here, you. Alright, so I still need to go up there and clean more. You are a butt. Probably weren't always a butt, but you sure are now. Yeah, The closest. Close enough with this man's bot. Hiya! And fuego, baby. So let's see, we're getting. Let's start by getting the crates out of this area. 
And eventually we do have to go up there, but not right now. Right now, let's just do a little bit of spatial tidying. Hiya! I'm so strong. Mm. I would date me. <laughs> if I could just chuck these giant metal bins all over. Metal crates. Oh, yeah. Hwa! Watch out! Hop ya! Huh! That's right, get over there! Just like I told you. <laughs> oh man. And there are times when it becomes repetitive, but I have been practicing having a. Uh, making the most of my trips. And it's a little hard when you're trying to do a Let's Play video and be efficient. But you know what? Let's see if I can stack to the occasion, because, hmm, just maybe I can. We'll find out, huh? Let's find out. Especially with these sweet beats going on behind us. Boy, if that doesn't motivate you to clean. Nice, tidy tunes. Yeah. Okay, give. Uh, yeah, okay. We can. Got all the content out there. Let's stick you here. See, here's butt. Boop. <laughs> Gonna boop a booty. Alright. Nope, not quite like that. There we go. Alright. And I'm using this because we're getting really close to the end of our organic matter that we need to bin. Oh y'all. Getting down to maybe a few bucket things. Alright, there's a bucket. Yeah, I gotta bring the harm up here. Alright, so here's another crate. Hoo ya! And here's another crate. Hoo ya! Okay, so. Yeah, we'll take you. Hello, guy! How you doing? Had better days? I know, Mondays can just be the worst, huh? Yeah, hard to drag yourself out of the weekend. Ugh. Don't worry though, we've got some sweet beats, right? Doesn't that help? Doesn't that motivate you a little bit? Especially when you have the thing cranked up to max and the bass is so good, the boombox looks like it's twerking. <laughs> yeah! Oh good, I thought I'd drop it on the ground. Okay, so we'll leave this open. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's just gonna get in the way. Alright, what do you have? Nothing. Oh, I don't want to do that. Okay. And it, it well. Oh yeah, would you like a bucket of fire? I had one. <laughs> and sometimes it is great fun to just oh, come here. Come here. There we go. To just pull it over! <laughs> okay, that wasn't nearly as, you know, climactic as it can be sometimes. But we'll get there. We'll get there. All right. So let's check behind here. Any stuff to grab? The answer is no. All right. So, uh, yeah. And to my knowledge, if you stack things and they sit outside of the bounds of the space, you know, the line, then they do not count as being properly stacked, and therefore. Do not go towards a bonus score, and, hooray, and they also go against your score. So worth it, if you're going to do stacking, to make sure that it's done properly. Do, do, do. Smash. <laughs> uh, it's nice that they have these notches to kind of line up a little bit. If you have things way off to the side, like that, that doesn't count as stacked. It's got to be close to center aligned. All right, so garlic, extinct harvester revived. Either way, we look forward to the future, however brief. <laughs> well, you're all dead now, so, you know. Oh. Jingo, pop it. 
Patriot Cola, the legendary name behind Jingo Pop and Fat Man, are launching a galaxy-wide campaign to promote their new soft drink, Jingo Pop Ultra, in hopes of raising awareness and further closing the market. Patriot Cola are urging everyone across the galaxy to honor their heroes in the best way possible by making it fun. This so-called Jingo Pop It mission encourages everyone to follow their example and do what they do. Will you Jingo Pop It? <laughs> From GNN1. <laughs> in case you you know, in case you didn't have enough politics, let's have some space politics. You know? In case you know you wanna watch Star Wars episode one. Boop. We don't have to be too careful. This is the first level, you know, they're just saying like, hey, by the way, you can stack stuff. It's kinda of fun. It can be a bit of a challenge. If you're into that. You don't have to, but if you're not going to, and you care about your score at all, then you've got to at least incinerate them. Oh. Big guy, come here. You are bigger than that one. I will put you on top. Because that is how physics dictate. Well. I mean, you could put the smaller one. It's just going to be a huge pain in the butt. Now, the one nice thing about these guys is that because of their little clips, you can stack them, and they kind of hold each other in place a bit. And that's about it. Otherwise, these orange ones are the bane of my stacking existence. Get out of here. Alright, so let's try to get all the demon orange ones out of the way first. Get out of here. Get out of here. Gonna get Randy Savage on you. And there we go. Yeah. I don't know anything about Randy Savage other than the name Randy Savage. Do, 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 do. Sure, I'll put you there for now. Let's, then I like to take one of these little crates, little beep boops, and we use it to stack more crates without knocking them all over. Sure, there. Now, obviously, it is hard to get these guys stacked very well. Da, da, da. Oh, that's the business right there. That's, mmm. Oh, that's good. Delicious. Delicious and nutritious. Made of orange. Okay. So, what else do we have going on here? Do, 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 do. I want to make more space. One, two. Usually the rule of thumb is two when you're doing wall ones. One, two. One, two. <laughs> and you can see how things are <laughs> stacked up. It's kind of... I think it's neat <laughs> to see how uh, the game has decided to layer various textures and effects. Oh, that's not done all the way. No, it's not done all the way. There we go. All right, what does this say? Warning! Classified life forms have escaped containment. All security teams, section five. All other personnel are to evacuate the area immediately. Well, well, you know what? Even though we found all these people dead, we don't know how many survived. We don't know how many life forms escaped to cause trouble. We don't know how many life forms were killed. We've not found any dead life forms. We've only found uh, life form juice. So, you know, we, we don't know the full story. We just know bits and pieces. And if you want to do a super thorough playthrough, you're going to take those bits and pieces and you're going to kind of reconstruct in your report what exactly happened to the best of your ability, who died first, how they died, you know, how is the state of their remains, <laughs> their bits, bits and pieces. Okay, so we did that. Let's see, we got that area. Alright, there's nothing behind there. Nothing behind there. Bunch of barrels. We'll get to you in a minute. You just wait. Okay, nothing there. What about over here? 
Nope, nothing there. Uh, oh, let's check the ground. A lot of times I like to hide on the ground sometimes. Alright. Okay, spinny, spinny. Knock. <laughs> so this laser definitely has some force to it. Not only does it knock around body parts, but it'll knock around crates a bit too. See? Look at that. <laughs> okay. So, guns. Nope. Bullets. Nope. We'll go back up there in a bit for now. We are busy. Now we're busy. Alright. And two. And see, the tip of my gun becomes red. It will overheat, and when it overheats, that's when it causes the small fire, the divot, and the little soot traces. Which, oh boy, we're gonna encounter some volatile and incendiary things. So if you end up causing uh, laser fires all over, you're gonna have a bad time. <laughs> maybe I'll show you guys, maybe I'll show you what happens when uh, your player can die. My, you know, my character can die. I don't know if there's a third person button. If there is, I just don't care that much. Maybe I'll figure it out if you guys want me to. And it exists, you know, assuming both of those things are true. That you want to see it and that it exists at all. Then I'll show you, but for the main part, I just don't care. I have a fine enough time in first person. I don't feel a need for third person, but yeah, we definitely have a full body, and we are a janitor. We're in kind of like the full body suits that you saw everyone else in. Ours is just a different color, and in some of the later levels, we will see some leavings of other janitors or their suits. <laughs> So, see, here's one on the floor. Wow! Get it. Okay, good. <laughs> Get it carefully. You want it gone, not multiplied. Alright. Okay, so I think for now, this. We have almost all the. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. Alright. So, let's get back up here. And we'll try to finish cleaning up this mat. We. I want to show you the other bits. Some of them have nothing, some of them have something really cool. This game has lots of references, lots of... Oh, that's always upsetting. Lots of references, lots of hidden things. Um, there's a hidden thing that I haven't found yet. I, I read about it, but I haven't found it myself yet. So... Uh, but that's not uh, for a while. That's not for a while. No rush, really. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Another reason that I didn't just put a bucket on here, you know? Uh, I've done that enough times to know that it's just not worth the dang old hassle. <laughs> J-harm is good for J-hassles. <sighs> and it can hassle right off about it. Boop. Okay, so... We have these barrels. These barrels are all safe to incinerate if you decide that you just don't want to deal with it. Let's see. We can ugh, stack them. Again, you, you want to make sure that they're as close to centered as you can. You can stack them three. I've stacked them four high to, uh, four tall before. Now, another thing to note is that if you're going to stack things, they can't be exactly touching like this. See how this one's leaning because it's, its hitbox is touching this one's? Yeah, that's that's a no-no. Then neither of them count. <laughs> so, you want to... If you're going to stack, you want to do it in a good way. I swear, that sounds so much like a Doom track. Am I wrong? It just really sounds like something from Doom. What is this one called again? Monkey fire. Here, come over here. We'll jam. We'll jam as we stack. Let me know if anything's too loud. You know, I, I did do it. I have done a couple test recordings just to see what I thought, but that's no guarantee that my hearing is. Or should be the standard, of course. All right, let's right about there. Yes, I did it. And 
you know, being the first level, this level is very open, it's very forgiving, and you'll probably see what I mean by forgiving even more as we continue. But for now, <laughs> you know, it's a fun little intro, so I'm gonna finish up this level and batch out these videos, and we'll see what y'all think. So, I might just continue them anyway because I like them, and, or I like playing this game, and that's something that I wish to bring to the Let's Play community as a whole, and, you know, anyone that watches these. But, you know, it's not that I'm closed off to input. <laughs> Bye, y'all. And these barrels are much easier. The blue barrels are harder to stack. Just because they don't have the same ridges on them. So it's a little harder to line up the lips just right. And they don't have to be totally perfect. I'm not satisfied with that though. Uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, close enough. Uh, close enough. I deem it fine. Okay. Ooh, it's like there's little drawings on them. I'm not sure I've noticed that on the bottom before. That's neato. Oh, yeah. Another good reason to let's play stuff. It kind of forces your brain to pay attention to stuff. Oh, you naughty thing. It kind of forces your brain to pay attention to stuff that you've missed in the other 15, 20 playthroughs you've done of a game, you know? Or, a, or even a level. So I very much am looking forward to finding things that I've missed. And maybe you will find things that I have missed. So, I will. Usually once I complete a level and I receive a high enough score, I'll delete the save. Not that it takes up so much hard drive space, but I just don't feel like <sighs> having it around is beneficial. That's not good. Come here, you. Yeah. <sighs> And we still have more barrels here, still have more crates, blah blah blah. We'll all get there. So let's see. We'll put the leggy legs in in here. Alright. And what is th oh careful. It is part of a head. Oh yeah! Okay, so that's part of the eye socket. Oh, there we go. See, part of the skull. We're looking right into the eye socket. Okay, there's the temple. Okay, figured it out. Figured it out. Okay. Leg! Sometimes it's easier to just, boop, do things like that. Alright, so what else can we do to make our life a little easier? We only have uh, for five barrels left to stack. Let's do it. Let's do it. And hua! And then we'll grab a crate. Yeah. And then we'll grab barrel. Do 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 do. Rinse and repeat. Yeah. Ha! Get out of here. Oh yeah, we got to get the little geometric ones too. I usually burn those guys. I do not like them, but I'm challenging myself lately to try to hold on to them, try to stack them, try to incorporate them into uh, my procedures. And just see how it goes, see if I ugh, end up just having a bad time or what. Because, you know, this is video games. It's supposed to ultimately be fun. And speaking of being video games, I have to unfortunately pause it here for us. So, happy gaming, and let's see if I can properly record the next video. <laughs> oh, save. Boop! Boops, boops, boops. Alright. Happy gaming. See you then.